Hi, this is Brent with Kansas Hydrographics. We are doing our one of our probably longest videos today. Uh, it's a tech video. We're doing a, this is a 1976 rear fender for a VW Beetle. Uh, we're going to be doing it on a wild dog print. Let's get this on the water. Start our minute soak, soak time. Get these bubbles out. If we see any? Got some? Yeah, got a couple over here. You got a couple seconds to get these bubbles out. The big one there on the end. Luckily, that's probably not in our dipping area. It should be okay. This is kind of a difficult dip. Um, We'll have to articulate this fender in and roll it. So it's, a, it's not just a straightforward dip. And we're fighting the time to get the bubbles out so we can get this done. Usually I only get to do pattern review videos. Today I guess I get to show you guys something a little bit more fancy. This is our new activator. Uh, we developed this about a month ago. I guess I'm not putting gloves on today. <laughs> There's a good chance I do take a swim. This is the fourth one of these I've done. Tattoos too. I'm all sleeved out, so that's kind of cool. But that's our wild bomb uh, on our white base coat paint, uh, Kansas Hydrographics Activator. Uh, we're naming it Hydro Gator Activator. Thank you guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, you could do this similar with uh, motorcycle um, tanks or fairings. You've got to not only get it in, but you've got to roll it in feed it into the pattern to keep your stretch way down. So, thanks you guys. I'll see you next time. <laughs>